Hello and welcome to the Video Game Valley. It is a beautiful day out today. It's we're <laughs> we're sitting in a little a little field in the valley. There's some flowers. It's a lovely <laughs> lovely day. A perfect 72 degrees. And today, for the first time, for the first time ever, we're playing. We're playing uh, on the Game Boy Advance. <laughs> We're playing on the Game Boy Advance, thanks to uh, thanks to the Wild Bunny. Thank you, the Wild Bunny, for sending in uh, the Game Boy Player for the GameCube to allow this to to, to work out. <laughs> Got uh, decided a, a new location in the valley would be good <laughs> for this, so I've I've walked over to a nice little field with some nice little flowers, and uh, I hope <laughs> I hope I hope this uh, this isn't too jarring for people. I hope. <laughs> I know change is scary. Change is very scary. It's it's frightening. It's spooky. It's like, oh no, oh no, what's happening? <laughs> but uh, but I like I like this I like this little uh, little field here. It's a good <laughs> good little field. So so today we got I got a few games. I uh, I got a, a few games uh, uh, picked out for today. Um, a lot of the games that I'm the most looking forward to playing on the Game Boy Advance are not ones we're playing today. It's <laughs> they're they're not ones that we're playing today. Instead, I'm playing the ones that I don't think necessarily would <laughs> like a whole stream would work out for, I guess. I guess that's the way to say it. So I got the first game we're playing is uh, a, a Sabrina the Teenage Witch game. Which I am looking forward to this game, although I don't know how good it's going to be. So <laughs> I want to want to play a few of them today. How is everyone doing today? How are you all? Will you play Kirby at some point? Yes, I have a Kirby game. I have a <laughs> I have one of the the Kirby's on the Game Boy Advance, and I will play that, but not tonight. Hey Jason, your Joker video made my grandpa laugh really hard and made my day. Thanks for putting so much laughter into the world. Wish I could tip you, but I'm poor. Well, thank, I'm glad, <laughs> glad, the, glad the videos, glad the videos uh, made made you laugh, made your your grandpa laugh. That's that's why I make them for laughter. If people see my videos and they just they just cry, I, don't, <laughs> I wouldn't I wouldn't keep making them. That would be that would be the worst. I'm okay, but my boyfriend broke up with me last night. Oh, sorry, sorry, Molly. That sucks. That sucks, Molly. That's... <laughs> uh, well, you know what? You know what? That, that, that's no good. That's no good, Molly. You, you deserve better, Molly. Molly. Molly, I hope... <laughs> things, things will work out, Molly. Don't, don't, things will work out. I mean, it's possible they won't, but I, I think there's a 99% chance <laughs> they'll, they'll work out. I don't want to say I hate it when people are when something bad happens and people tell me everything will be fine because my brain won't accept that. Just absolutely, <laughs> just my brain will absolutely not accept that everything will be fine because I know there's the chance it won't be fine. So I appreciate it when people are just like, just, <laughs> just like, oh, I'm sorry that this happened. Instead of it's uh, everything is fine. Don't worry. <laughs> don't think about pain. You can't think about pain at all. If you think about pain, then I have to think about pain. Don't do it. <laughs> uh, well, let's get this this game started. I mean, we're still gonna be friends. Okay, I'm glad. <laughs> I thought for a second about about bad mouthing your 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 ex who I don't know anything about, and then I was like, well, I don't know what kind of terms they ended on. <laughs> this could be exactly not what Molly wants to hear. <laughs> Oh, I got a, got a, got a ginger beer today, and it's, it's doing, doing a lot of good. Let me tell you, I, I was sitting here like, oh, I'm thirsty. I need something to drink. And then I was like, oh yeah, I got <laughs> my ginger beer like I do literally every time. Perfect. Everything happens for a reason is a phrase that makes me sad, makes me mad. Yeah, yeah, it makes me mad too. Yeah, everything, everything happens for a reason. This thing happened because... Because the, the the universe is cold and merciless. <laughs> That's the reason. That is that is the reason. 
All right, let's go. Oop. Here we go. <laughs> English. Sabrina, the teenage witch. Potion commotion. <laughs> this is the, the first one, the first one we're starting with. Hephaestus, thank you for the $2. $2 for the deepness. The deep, dark deepness. <laughs> thank you. $2 deepness. That's about... That's about how, how, how much my deepness is worth. I think my deepness is about $2 worth of deepness. Green23, thank you for the $5. The various slappings will ensue, Daddy. What is that? <laughs> oh, the slappings. They're, sure. They're, they're happening, I guess. Alright, press start. Oh, whoa. <laughs> new game? Yeah, sure. Let's, let's do a new game. Wish I had a date tonight. Sighs Hilda, nostalgic about her own days as a teenage witch. <laughs> oh my god, this is... <laughs> There's gotta be some fanfiction that just opens up with those exact lines. Like, this is... <laughs> this is the most fanfiction writing already. In just, like, the first line. Perfect. <laughs> Perfect. Later, in the kitchen. With a little dough and a touch of magic, I can make the perfect date for tonight. Sabrina enters the kitchen. Ordinary objects are spinning around the kitchen, and Hilda has become stiff as a statue. Looks like Hilda missed her spell again, Zelda says as she enters the kitchen. There's a lot of, <laughs> a lot of use of the word kitchen here. Sabrina, you must find the four ingredients to set Hilda free. <laughs> like, so the story of this is... <laughs> the story of this is, uh... Hilda. Hilda was too, too, uh, too horny. Did some, <laughs> did some, uh... Did some unsafe magic, and it all turned up, turned out wrong. It's up to you now. Hey, Sabrina! Zelda asked me to show you a thing or two to help you complete your adventure! I know this is not what the cat sounded like. I, <laughs> I did watch this show. That's just, you know, that's my, my go-to animal voice, I guess. Carly, thank you for the 10 Canadian. Those cutscenes, though. This is beautifully painful. Yeah, it's... <laughs> yes, this is both beautiful and painful. That's... <laughs> The perfect way to put it, thank you, thank you. You'll need to be as agile as a cat! By pressing the control pad left or control pad right, you'll walk around! If you press control pad down, you'll crouch! Oh, there, the cat, there they go. <laughs> okay, yep. Yeah, the cat was right. That's, that's exactly what this does. Oh, we can jump too. Man, Sabrina can jump really high. <laughs> Jeez. Oh, what is this? Okay, sure. How's it, how's it going, cat? While walking, you can press and hold B button to run. If you release B button, you'll return to your walking speed. Oh, I pushed the wrong. <laughs> keep pushing the wrong button. Uh, bye. Yeah. Free the Sloths! Thank you for the $10. They should make a sequel to this game. They should call it Sabrina and the Teenage Witch Trials. Abigail's life would change forever when she met Sabrina. Yes. <laughs> this does kind of look like their living room. That's pretty cool. Yeah, yeah, it does. <laughs> Oh, follow me! Use A jump to the A button to jump! Alright. Oh, man. That's some good jumping, Ken. So far, this is... I'm, I'm into this. <laughs> this is... This is good. Good job, game developers. Hey, look what I found! It's a page of a magic book! Seems to be some pieces missing, though. If you find the two other pieces, you'll learn a new spell. You figure it out, and I'll wait for you on the second floor. Bye. I'm glad they. <laughs> I'm glad they have this camera set up so it's like 
you get to watch the characters go away. That's nice. That's nice. I like it. Yeah. Can I pick up the phone? Is that a phone? <laughs> I don't... The only way to get around this house is through, <laughs> through jumping on the furniture and stuff. Sure. That sounds, that sounds about right. You're really cutting down on my nap time. Oh, yeah. Okay, see this thing beside me? It's a magic jar. When you see one, it means that the quiz master wants to challenge you. <laughs> if you successfully accomplish this challenge, it'll make you a stronger witch. Okay. Match identical cards by turning them one at a time. Oh man, the Quizmaster's got some tricky games, huh? <laughs> oh, sure, what else? <laughs> uh, pizza slice, sure. What do you think? What do you think's gonna be in the next one we overturn? What do you... <laughs> Shoot. Yeah! Whoa, they burned away! Bur oh no. Oh <laughs> no, that complicates things. Oh god, I thought it was gonna do real good, but I don't think it's gonna happen. Oh no. Oh god. Yeah! Boop, boop. <laughs> Flower, is that this? Yes. Perfect. Oh god, where's the where's the pencil? No. Oh no. Okay. Yeah. A hot pizza. Yes. <laughs> Perfect. Notepad. Notepad. Why is my score not going up? Well, I did seven, alright. No, but seriously, why did my score not go up when I was getting stuff? <laughs> I don't understand. Whoa, that phone's got some problems. <laughs> What's up with that crazy telephone? I think we should lay low until it stops swinging its receiver and then jump over it. Wait, what? <laughs> okay, I think I read that wrong. Or it was written wrong, it's hard to know. I'll go first, follow me. Blah, 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 blah. Glad Sabrina can jump so, so high. This should make Zelda happy. It's one of the four ingredients we need to unfreeze Hilda. Three more to go, but I don't think we'll find them around here. Bloop, 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 bloop. <laughs> Woo! Oh, man. Jason, I love the setup. Good job. Thank, <laughs> thank you. I'm, I'm pleased with it. And once again, once again, the super thanks to the Wild Buddy. I'm so, <laughs> I'm so excited to be able to play GBA games on stream now. Cause look at this, look at this game! <laughs> this game is really good! Woo! Woo! Hey, good work! That's the third page of the magic book! Using all three pieces, you can now cast Lullaby. It's the best thing you'll find to put animated objects to sleep. Now just go to the hyperactive boiler. Stop and press R button. Okay. Bye, bye cat. The Wild Bunny, thank you for the uh, the ten dollars. Jason, I love the bunny drugs, and I'm so glad you get to add GBA games to your streams. I actually need to duck out for a conference call for a bit, but I'll be watching the gameplay on silent. Cool. Well, have have a good conference call. The uh, conference call, the Wild Bunny, and thank you, thank you, thank you once again. Thank you so much. <laughs> All right. Well, that did it. I unmade that that pot. I hope I wasn't alive. <laughs> I really hope. It was not alive. Yep. 
I don't know if you noticed, but casting a spell will cost you some magic points. To get more, you need to collect these crystal balls. If you ever lose hearts, you can repli- If you ever <laughs> lose hearts, <laughs> you can replenish your life meter using little hearts. Not a lot of- Not a lot of Q&A in this game, that's fine. <laughs> Oh cool, I can't pick up the heart because I don't I don't need it. Good. Are you gonna play Astro Boy the Omega Factor? Yes. Yeah, I've got I got a repro of that coming in. There's a couple uh, GBA games that most GBA games I found were like a dollar, two dollars, <laughs> something like that. Uh, but uh, some of them some of them real real pricey, so I've I've ordered uh, repros. That gate only opens once. You have found all the needed items. If it stays closed, it means that you forgot something. After the gate is... After the gate is the... The, the exit door. <laughs> Cross the door, just press control pad up. Boop boop. Here we go. Look at those lights. Look at those lights up there. That's nice. They didn't need to put that there, but they did. And that was a good choice. I like it. <laughs> I like it. Jason, can I ask you something? Yes, go ahead and ask it. I might not see, <laughs> might not see your question in chat, but go ahead. Why GBA? Because I love the GBA now that I can play it. <laughs> Before I could play it, I was like, I don't know about this GBA, but now that I can play it, I'm like, yeah, no, this is really good. <laughs> I played some GBA games when I was, uh, when I was younger, but uh, I didn't have a GBA, so... I didn't get to play it too many. I was always like, well, it's probably not that good anyway. <laughs> Do you own any Game Boy Advance videos? No. No, I do not. I got a password. Remember this password, everyone. <laughs> uh, Alright, well, I don't really know what this means. Any SpongeBob games from GBA? Yes, I have. I have a SpongeBob game. I think. I think so. <laughs> I got a SpongeBob Game Boy Color game coming in too. I guess we'll pick this. Oh no, I think this is not what we were supposed to pick. <laughs> well, time to go all the way back up. Gotta get out of here. <laughs> oh, oh no. Oh god. Oh god. No. Jesus. <laughs> oh, I can't go back for the hearts. Slide whistle. Yes, yeah, perfect. Oh no. Man, I. <laughs> this game's getting really intense, huh? Another ingredient. <laughs> no, get out of here. I hate you. <laughs> no. Maggie is tired. Thank you for the four ninety nine. Jason, my cat keeps stealing. My chips and running away. Tell him to stop being mean. Also, I think you're great. Cat? Don't steal the chips, cat. <laughs> I mean, 
you know, maybe Maggie shouldn't be so stingy with the chips. <laughs> but also, stealing's wrong. Don't do it. Maggie's so nice to you, I'm sure. Even though she's so stingy with the chips. But also, you know, you're a cat. Oh no, I don't have enough magic. <laughs> oh no, I'm defenseless. Oh no, oh no, the worst thing. Oh god, get out of here. Oh no, I have to go all the way back, alright. Okay. Okay, you got this, Sabrina. Man, I wish this stuff didn't all respawn. Jason, I'm not stingy. I gave him one, now he wants more. Sounds just like a cat. You give the cat... Oh my god, what is this? <laughs> you give the cat one chip and just... It just wants chips forever. What kind of chips are they? <laughs> what kind of chips? My cat wants to eat a lot of stuff, but usually not like potato chips. Watch and remember, then reproduce. The color- oh yeah. The color sequence that I'll, that I'll show you. If you're right, I'll add another color to the sequence until you beat my score. Blue. Red. Oh no, just blue. Alright. Blue, blue. 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 Fritos. I don't think my cat would eat Fritos. But clearly, your cat cannot get enough Fritos. That was, that was tough. <laughs> Is that it? Alright, I guess I'm leaving. Bye! Hey! It's books. Man, why are so many things alive in this house? <laughs> This is no good, that's what I think. Now we got another password. Cool. Oh no, wait, what? Oh god, what? <laughs> what is what is happening? Why? No, seriously, what is- what is going on? Why is this- <laughs> Why is there a wall of death coming after Sabrina? And in her own home, no less. Get out of here, TV. Alright. Vegito, thank you for the two dollars. Here's for future GBA Pokemon marathons. Yeah, I've got uh, I've got Emerald and Leaf Green on the GBA, and I will de <laughs> I'll definitely play those at some point. Man. Oh, cool! Match identical cards by turning one at a time. Here, here we go. Okay, pencil, shoe, cat, flower, flower, yeah, we did it. <laughs> oh, God. Lava land, lava, oh my God, look at that. <laughs> Amazing. Would you play on DS? I have no way to play DS games on, on stream, sorry. <laughs> uh, I can currently play Game Boy, Game Boy Color, and Game Boy Advance games. I honestly have no idea how to how to stream DS games. 
Pizza. Cool. Pizza again. Fish? No. Oh, pizza. <laughs> Leaf. Cat. This is cat, right? Yes, cat. Gaming played uh, Sabrina the Teenage Witch Potion Commotion. Jason, do you have the American Idol GBA game? No, I do not. <laughs> Pencil. <laughs> Jason, I saw you only have Game Boy Advance listed on your collection page. Did you not buy any Game Boy Color games? Uh, I have. I ordered some off eBay and they have not come in yet. And then I'm picking up some more when I go to the game store. The used game store uh, this, this Wednesday, I think. Is this fish? No, that's shoe. Yeah! Alright. Huh? 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 I know! <laughs> the thing is back! Oh god. Woo! Oh no! When do I hit and I'm dead? Oh, hey, cat. How's it going? Hi. With a mini bean spell, you'll be able to plant beans in the pots. That's a whole spell. <laughs> what? Hey, did you notice the death wall? Let me... <laughs> it may help you to climb to higher places if you key that you can't reach. Oh, uh, okay. Whoa. Whoa, look at this. The house is ruined. <laughs> what is this game? This is, uh, uh... This is, this is Pokemon. <laughs> that's, that's what this is. It's Pokemon. Alright, well, I think, <laughs> I think that's enough of the Sabrina game. I'm gonna switch games now. I'm gonna switch... I gotta, I gotta take a vote. I got, I got a few games on the lineup. Are you ready? I'm gonna, I'm gonna name the games, and then you, you tell me which one I should play. I have here on the table in front of me. <laughs> Charlie and the Chocolate Factory, Dinotopia, the Time Stone Pirates, Jackie Chan Adventures, Legend of the Dark Hand, Polly Pocket, Super Splash Island, Unfabulous, and Shrek Hassle at the Castle. So go, <laughs> go ahead and vote for one of those. One of those will be the next up. Okay. It seems... It seems as if most votes are... Okay. <laughs> it seems most votes are for Jackie Chan and Shrek. So I'm going to go ahead and start with Jackie Chan and then we'll move to Shrek, all right? <laughs> so that's, that's what we're going to do. Here we go. Jackie Chan, Adventures. Legend of the Dark Hand. Oh, I like this music so far. <laughs> it's very good. Yeah, Legend of the Dark Hand. Options.
difficulty. Definitely easy. Watch the store while I go to buy some tea. Hey, Jackie, I'll give you a hand. Okay. Uh, can I help you? I'm looking for eight ancient scrolls. We don't have any scrolls. <laughs> Give me the scrolls! I told you, we don't have any scrolls. Come on! <laughs> Why does... <laughs> Why is Jackie Champion attacked by anime? Why is it happening? Uh, and, uh... Ah, the scroll. Valmont will be pleased. <laughs> Yes, Valmont. My, my Dark Lord Valmont, I guess. Jackie, that scroll is one of the eight that bestow ancient Kung Fu powers. They must not fall into the wrong hands. I'm all over it. Uh, I think you have homework, dude. Besides, we should leave this to the professionals. And risk letting the Dark Hand harness the scroll's powers for evil? Yeah, and if we get the scrolls, they'll give us the ancient art of butt whoop magic style. Fine, I will retrieve the scrolls. But Jane, you will stay with Uncle. Oh. One more thing. One. Be careful, Jackie. Alright. Okay, so... I can punch very slowly. <laughs> this seems like... Very un Jackie Chan sort of moves, but sure, Jackie Chan can do regular kick. <laughs> this looks like a Y kick. I don't know. Can I cook? Can I cook the uh, the nail thing? Yeah. Oh my God. <laughs> I really messed this thing up, huh? Perfect. Can I jump? <laughs> no. Oh no, I can jump. It's just the trigger buttons, sure. Uh, yeah. 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 <laughs> can I pick this up? Can I pick up the umbrella? No. No. Alright. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> sure. Jackie Chan's going around just destroying all the property. Oh my god, what did I just kick? Just some random... Random dudes? Who are these people? Are they even... <laughs> are they even bad, bad people? What's going on? Hey. Hey, take... Take these punches. Oh no. Oh god, I <laughs> keep accidentally pushing the menu button. Why didn't they just use normal sprites? I don't know, this sounds... This looks... This looks fine. This is fine. Fun fact about the Jackie Chan cartoon series, it was all voiced by his double, I mean by his, oh my god, I missed, sorry, the, the chat scroll by, by his voice double despite the fact that he did show up in the after episode segments. That makes sense. He didn't have time. <laughs> For whatever this nonsense was. Why can't I pick up this umbrella? It looks like you can pick it up, right? It looks like something you can pick up. Hey, get over here. Yeah, look at all those kicks I'm doing. Oh my god. <laughs> get, get, get over here. Oh god, no. Yeah. Jackie Chad kills someone behind this dumpster. <laughs> he runs like a dork, yes. Okay, so so far I think the Sabrina game is better than <laughs> this one. 
the Sabrina game at least controlled reasonably well. This one is kind of real slow. Oh my god, no! No! Put that down, that's dangerous! <laughs> I cannot believe how slow everything is. Like, you can't tell on stream. But when I push a button, it takes a while for Jackie Chan to realize that something's happened. <laughs> Seriously, there's just like one guy. There was one guy who, uh... Who... Hurt Jackie Chan or something. And stole a scroll. Why is Jackie Chan just going around beating up literally everyone else? There's no way that all of these people are... <laughs> are, uh part of the same crew, the same anime group that <laughs> left of those, those scrolls. Well, if I push, <laughs> I push kick enough times, Jackie seems to, to do some little jumps. Yeah, this game not great. <laughs> what if you jump on the dumpster? Oh well, I guess we'll never know. It decided. To <laughs> it looks like he went down this street. Yeah, mess up that bush, <laughs> Jackie Chan. That's right, Jackie Chan, infamous hater of foliage. <laughs> I just can't stand fo fo foliage. That's right. What was that? <laughs> what did I get? Hey, hey! What are you doing? You jerk! Get out of here! Get out of here, you son of a gun! What are you doing? Well, I guess I beat all the bad guys. This is... Oh, what, what voice should I use for Chow? <laughs> is that Chow? Or is... Is Chow... Is, uh, no, I, I'm missing... I'm missing the lines now. Get him, boys! Strangers around here! Get it! Get him, boys! Strangers! <laughs> Alright, well I imagine the whole game is gonna be this, so I guess we we can switch to <laughs> switch to Shrek. I'm sure this game will come up again at some point in a future stream. Maybe six months from now, maybe a year. Who knows? Or maybe I'll never play it again. Tapers are underappreciated. Thank you for the five dollars. Imagine if the scrolls really weren't there. Uh, sorry, I trashed your business and gave you a concussion. Ha, <laughs> my bad, bro. No hard feelings, right? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that never happens. Alright. I'm out of here. I'll leave this to Finn. Oh, is there a boss coming up? No. Alright. <laughs> Alright, well, it's time to, uh, time to load up some Shrek, then. Are you ready for some Shrek hassle in the castle? I have no idea what the game is about, but apparently there's some sort of hassle going on in some sort of castle. Dreamworks, huh? Oh yeah, Shrek. <laughs> I don't know why that surprised me at all. It was a dark and stormy night. Shrek, castle of the castle, press start. Ah, uh, sure. Options. Yeah, these are some options. Difficulty. Why is... 
Why is the select thing a happy face? What is going on? <laughs> what? What? What is this? What is this game? Story mode. I did it. Okay, apparently someone has <laughs> someone has saved some games with this this used copy I got. Erase. Erase. There's someone <laughs> someone saved games in three slots. Someone played a lot of this. A lot of this hassle in the castle. Level one. Shrek Swamp. Oh, the. Once upon a time, in a faraway swamp, there lived an onery ogre named Shrek. This lecture is supposed to be Gingy the Gingerbread Man. Yeah, that makes sense. <laughs> Shrek enjoyed his peaceful life without any disturbances from the outside world. This is Shrek's story. Level 1, Shrek Swamp. 1-1, one, one, Wanted, Ogre Reward. Oh, there- <laughs> There's Shrek. Classic Shrek look. Ah. Get all of the villagers out of Shrek Swamp. Sure. Level start. Uh, 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 uh. Oh no! <laughs> Uh, 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 uh. Whoa. Alright. <laughs> sure. I want that coin. What is that coin? Alright, so so far, this game is a lot. <laughs> this game is a whole lot so far. Seriously, I really want this this coin. Oh, there you go. <laughs> Shrek looks so happy. Uh, uh. You coming down? No. All right. Yes, I know I could do B and A. I know, but there's no one around. It wouldn't make a whole lot of sense. Is this the whole game? Yeah, I guess so. I guess so, sure. Well, I did it. Level 1, Shrek Swamp. 1, 2, Meeting Donkey. Alright. Rescue, defeat. Rescue Donkey and defeat the guard captain, sure. Can you run? Oh yeah, I guess I can. Thank you. <laughs> Uh. Hey! Here comes Shrek! Uh. <laughs> uh. Shrek is a big boy! Oh no! Oh, uh, Shrek is dead. Sorry, Shrek's dead! Shrek's gone! <laughs> Level start. Uh, 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 murder. Kill everyone. Hey, hey, you son of a gun. Get out of here. <laughs> uh. Coins. Co oh, oh. <laughs> oh, God. So this game. For some reason, the uh, the jumping and the punching happens immediately, but the the turning Shrek around, not so much. <laughs> Shrek Shrek takes a second to realize that that you want to want to turn his big boy bot around. No. Uh, it makes precision platforming difficult. Up oh, like that. <laughs> yeah. Continue.
Shrek lives in a swamp but dies when he touches water. <laughs> yes. This is the point we can't get past. All right, good, good to know. Oh, no! You son, you sons of guns! Yep. <laughs> Perfect jumps. Perfect. Only perfect jumps. Yes. <laughs> we, oh no. We did it. We did it, everyone. Look at that. Shrek is a big perfect boy. Hey, it's Donkey. Oh god. No, I gotta save the donks. We did it, we got Donkey. <laughs> cool. No. Blah. Can can Donkey do anything? Is there any <laughs> it's just Donkey just alone now? Is that it? Blah, blah, blah. Oh no. Alright. Aha, uh -huh, I got something. I don't, know, I don't know what that that is or what that does. Can you help me jump or something? What do you do? What do you do, donkey? Here we go on our big adventure. Oh my god, where did donkey go? What happened to donkey? <laughs> Donkey! Donkey, it's me, Shrek! Oi, don- Oi, Donkey! O oi, get- Get back here, Donkey! I need you, Donkey! I'm here to save you! Get over here, Donkey! <laughs> donkey, where are you going to, Donkey? Oh my god, I'm almost dead. I know. other. Perfect. <laughs> Alright, well, you know, I think that's that's enough of, uh, of Shrek. <laughs> Up next, we'll play, uh, go ahead and vote. <laughs> would, you, would you like Charlie and the Chocolate Factory, Unfabulous, Dinotopia, the Time Stone Pirates, or Polly Pocket, Super Splash Island? Seeing some votes for Polly Pocket. Seeing some Dinotopia votes. Alright, so Polly Pocket seems to have the most votes, and then Dinotopia, so... We'll start up Polly Pocket, and then we'll, we'll end the stream with Dinotopia. <laughs> that is what we shall do. Thank, thank you for your votes, everyone. <laughs> This, this important election. Oh no, uh, hold on one second. <laughs>
All right, there seems to be some problems with my Polly Pocket <laughs> cartridge, and it's not loading. So one, one, one second. I'm gonna go to the changing game screen and uh, try to get it fixed, and then I will be right back. Be right back, everyone. Hey, I got, I got it working. <laughs> I got Polly Pocket working. I just needed to clean the connectors. Uh, what is this? Okay, maybe it's not working. You know what? <laughs> you know what? It, okay, it was seeming to work. This is definitely not working. <laughs> All right, be right back again. All right, let's see if it works this time. <laughs> let's see if it if it works out. Yeah. Listen up, Color 9. Win six tickets to Super Splash Island. Call now. Whoa, my Polly Pals and I just won tickets to Super Smash Island. This place looks so much fun. Come on, let's go. Good story. <laughs> Great, you guys, I'm glad this is working now. Thank you, uh, thank you, Mike Prime for the five Canadian. Twitch analytics. Barbie Writing Camp is the least watched game on Twitch. I told the stream that the Charlie guy streamed it and they felt it made sense. <laughs> the least watched game on Twitch, huh? Man. <laughs> That's sad. I like, I like writing camp. Mike, thank you for the two Canadian. Don't worry, they were all very nice about it. That's good. <laughs> New game. Oh, uh, hey. Hey, just getting right into it, huh? Info booth. Yeah, let's go to the info booth. Uh, you know what? I don't care about the info boost. That's actually... <laughs> Water slide, sure. Hi! You need 2,000 tickets <laughs> to ride the giant water slide. Check out the other rides and come back when you have 2,000 tickets. <laughs> Password. B, 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 B. Alright. River crossing? Yeah, I guess I can go here. Cool. Easy. Boop -a -boop -boop -boop. Oh. <laughs> Way to go. Me. Yeah. Pop 
Polly Pocket. Yep. She's got some moves. That Polly. That pocket sized Polly. Oh no, the balloons are going away. I'm taking too long. Oh no. <laughs> Good. No, stop it. Man, this game is too stressful. expecting in this game, but you know what, sure. Let's get this, uh, this balloons. Ah, uh, we did it. Wah wahoo! Wah wahoo! Nathan, thank you for the two dollars. How do you know so much about string theory? That's a very good question. The answer is I read about it on Wikipedia. <laughs> Two hundred and ten tickets. Play again now. Password eight 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 eight. <laughs> really? Is that? Tube trouble. Oh, gonna run into a lot of trouble here. What? What's going on? <laughs> Man, I really should have. I uh, I really should have read the uh, the instructions, huh? Really, really should have read those. I gotta be honest. I have no idea. <laughs> I have no idea what I'm supposed to be doing here. I guess I'm getting balloons, but. Oh my god! What was that? <laughs> Dinosaur? Is there a reason to not just wait up here until the balloons come? Like, where would I go down here? Oh, there's a clock down there, I see. I can get that sweet clock. Yeah. Does that just give me more time? I don't want more time. <laughs> I want less time here. Oh my god. <laughs> So not, not a great game this <laughs> not a great game this one this this poly pocket that's okay you know they, they can't all be winners like like Shrek <laughs> wahoo 132 tickets well all right well <laughs> why is it always the same password why <laughs> there's no way there's no way that this password will give me my various amount of tickets every time I enter it. Well, I'm glad, glad this game worked. Glad, <laughs> glad this game worked. I need to go ahead and put in Dinotopia now. I <laughs> can load up that Dinotopia. Dino, Dinotopia. Come on. Where is it? Where did I put <laughs> where did I put Dinotopia? Oh, 
Oh no, Dinotopia is also freezing. One second, I, I gotta clean the Dinotopia cartridge. <laughs> Be right back. Hey, welcome back. Dinotopia's working. It's time for some Dinotopias. Wow, I just got here. How'd the wild bunny get featured? Uh, she said, yeah, she sent me the GBA player for GameCube, which allows me to stream these games now. English. Press start. <laughs> Look at me. It's the same music, but why did the why do you have it fade out and in? Options. Color correction? Wow, really? Sure. That's that's nice. <laughs> I haven't seen gamma options in uh, it's a game it's a Game Boy Advance game. I guess I guess like if you're outside maybe it's hard to see. Apparently they released premieres for YouTube VOD content. Will you try it out? Yeah, maybe. I think I think I'll try it out at some point, definitely. Save options. Oh. Oh, those weren't options for saves. Just save the options. Sure. Sure, why not? You have to use the Game Boy's contrast knob. Oh yeah, why why do they have <laughs> comma settings here? You know what? New game. Please wait. Clayton, you sure have picked an odd place to celebrate your graduation from. Flight school? This is where I found my first ancient artifact, I must say. Yala, I miss the thrill of that moment. But you just earned the trust of Stratus, your skybox. Isn't that thrilling? It is, Krekor. <laughs> to pilot a Skybax is a great honor, but sometimes I feel it's not enough for me or for Dinotopia. I feel I can do more. We agree. That's why we've come for you. The elders have just learned of a terrible threat to Dinotopia. Is this about the Tyrannosaurus trying to leave their nesting area? Yes, and we've just learned why. Pirates have stolen their eggs. Oh no! <laughs> Tyrannosaurus might be dangerous, but they have a right to live. Why have the pirates done this? They're after some kind of treasure. We're not sure what it is yet. They must think it's the Tyrannosaur nesting area. That must be why they took the eggs out. With the Tyrannosaurs gone, the pirates will be able to hunt for treasure and peace. But the Tyrannosaurs will think we took their eggs and come after us instead. It will- I won't- I won't let that happen. I'll find and return those eggs before the Tyrannosaurs leave their nesting area. I might even find the pirates' treasure before they do. That's why I brought this sunstone, Prad. <laughs> You can use it to defend yourself if the pirates attack. I'm sure you mean when they attack. Don't worry, I'm ready for them. Well, that's quite a story, huh? <laughs> I'm gonna move around like this. Hey, hey. Yep. Yep. Son of a gun. <laughs> oh no. Oh, oh, oh. 
Yes, I got a precious jewel. Die, die. Pirate scum. Wap, wap. Yep. Hey. Oh no. Oh no, I lost a heart. You took my favorite heart, you scoundrel. <laughs> Just try to hit me. Ha ha ha, I tricked you. <laughs> Why are those spikes coming out? What is what is the mechanism for this? Uh, I got heart potion, cool. Oh, 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 oh. oh, almost. Yes, I got the potion. Oh, oh. The potions are so they're they're whiskey. It's whiskey. <laughs> That's what the potions are. That's the only way I heal. Mmm, blue whiskey. <laughs> That's right. I don't know who, who I am. I don't, <laughs> I'm not familiar with Dinotopia. But I do know that my character just loves blue whiskey. Alright, those spikes don't go down. Those just stay up. What, 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 what? This is an effective weapon. You know what? Did you just try to stomach bump me? Yeah, you did. Jeez. <laughs> hey, no, no. Wet, wet, wet. Those dinos in the background. <laughs> Some good dinos. Yep. Jules, whiskey. Perfect. Well, this is. <laughs> I, had, I had high hopes for this game when the cutscene was so uh, interesting. <laughs> but uh, so far, it's just like clones of two dudes that I'm fighting over and over again. Oh no, I can't hit the spikes with my stick without getting hurt? <laughs> sure, you know what? It's Dinotopia. Life is different here. I have a sacred bond with my wax stick. When it gets hurt, I get hurt. Oops, I can't escape until I take the egg. Uh, uh I gotta find the egg. Alright. Oh god, am I gonna have to go back through the whole level? <laughs> Just look at this egg. Oh god. Oh my god. Where's the egg? I have a map or anything. <laughs> a map to the the egg. Why do I don't take fall damage? Uh, God, this level is just so big. How am I gonna find this son of a gun egg? How is it gonna happen? <laughs> How is it gonna happen that I stumble upon this egg? That's apparently too far down. All right, well we are we are past an hour, so I'm gonna go ahead and end the stream now. Thank you all for joining me for this <laughs> this co uh, collection of uh, Game Boy Advance games. I will be streaming more Game Boy Advance at some point. Uh, I gotta figure out 
my schedule for it. I want to I wanna at some point set up a day for Game Boy Advance games on account of I have this new lovely field to, to, to sit in and play some, uh, some, some GBA games. And I'll play the good ones. <laughs> I'll play, I'll play mostly the good ones, you know, the Pokemons, the, the Wario Worlds, the Golden Suns, that kind of stuff. What's your tablet? I got a, a Wacom, uh, Cintiq. Can I send you some fun GBA games? Uh, if you want to send me any games, wait, wait, wait about a week or two. Uh, I have a list in the description of the games that I have. And I have some more on order, so just to make sure you don't send stuff that I already have. I also have uh, my P.O. Box address there. The bad ones are so bad that they are good, though. Yes, I do. <laughs> I do like a lot of the bad ones. That's. I I like that the GBA has so many shovelware games. I really appreciate it. I like playing shovelware stuff. At some point, we'll have to set up, like, a GBA day where I just play 24 hours, <laughs> 24 hours of GBA games. Every half hour, we switch from one game to another. I missed the weather announcement. 72 degrees. Yes. Yeah, it's, it's 72 degrees. It's 72 degrees like everywhere in the valley. Except near the Lynx. <laughs> near the Lynx. The Lynx emanates a warmth. So I imagine like directly around the Lynx. It's a little bit warmer. But it's not like too warm. It's more of a like comforting my soul sort of warmth, I guess. <laughs> I guess that's what it is. I'm excited for Pokemon. Do you know what starter you'll pick? Uh, depends on what, which one I play. I don't remember, uh... The Wild Bunny, thank you for the $2. I'm still on my call, but have a good night, all. Good night, The Wild Bunny. Thank you, thank you again for sending, <laughs> for sending the GBA player in. What are the start, what are the starting Pokemon for, uh, p p uh, Emerald? <laughs> Let's see, Pokemon Emerald... Emerald... Starting t starters. Well, I'm definitely not going to pick Mudkip. <laughs> I'm not super familiar with any of these Pokemon. I usually go with grass or water. So I guess I'm going grass. So I guess I'm going Trico. Trico seems pretty cool. <laughs> it seems like a pretty cool lizard. Why not Mudkip? I just I just don't like Mudkip. <laughs> I'm sorry. I just don't like the Pokemon Mudkip. <laughs> Mudkip is so good. Mudkip is water and ground. Oh. <laughs> how is there Wi-Fi in the valley? You know what? That's a good question. I have no idea. <laughs> no idea how that works out. What, okay, so the other one I have is Leaf Green. That's just a remake of the original, right? Leaf Green. Yeah, so I'm, I'm going to pick uh, uh, Bulbasaur. Cause that's <laughs> that's what I went with in blue. Who is this shill of a man who that doesn't res rate Mudkip? What kind of a monster have we been supporting? <laughs> I'm sorry, I just don't like Mudkip. <laughs> like Mudkip's fine. 
Mudkip's Mudkip's all right. I'm just if I'm gonna pick between different Pokemon, Mudkip's gonna be lower on my list. I don't <laughs> I don't know something about Mudkip. Something about Mudkip. I just look at Mudkip and I'm like I don't know about this one. I don't know, <laughs> I don't know about this Pokemon. Torchic is a fire chicken. That is a pretty strong argument. I'm sorry, but if you hate Mudkip, got to unsub. Man, I didn't <laughs> didn't realize I was getting into some controversial territory with my with my not being into Mudkip stance. I had no idea. My career my career is over. <laughs> I've, ru I've ruined it. On stream. Jason said that they don't like Mudkip. Now, now Disney's dropped them. From, <laughs> they've been dropped from YouTube Red. Their career is over. Having Pokemon opinions is a dangerous game. <laughs> yeah, apparently. <laughs> I got I got a lot of po uh, Pokemon opinions, but I'm not. See, I have a lot of strong opinions on Pokemon, but I also don't really play a lot of Pokemon. Like I played Blue when I was young, and then I didn't play a single other Pokemon game until X. And then I played X, and I played part of uh, Moon, and that's that's my entire like experience with Pokemon. Who's your least favorite Pokemon? It's probably that that garbage Pokemon. <laughs> one who's literally garbage. I don't know. Like, that's my least favorite design. No, no, okay. Klefki is my least favorite design. The garbage Pokemon, I I can't say they're my least favorite because I, re I relate to a Pokemon who's a pile of garbage. <laughs> you, know what? I, you know, I can... I think, I think it just brings out too many internal feelings. But uh, Klefki... Klefki, I'm just like, you know what, I understand, I understand the, uh, the Japanese folklore stuff that it comes from, but it's still, <laughs> it's still a, just a key ring, you know? There's a Digimon that's a pile of trash. Isn't Muck a pile of garbage sludge? Yeah, Muck's fine, though. You know what? Muck's okay. <laughs> I like Muck. Dunsparce. Yeah, Dunsparce. <laughs> Dunsparce, and, it's Sparce is another one I'm not super into. Dunsparce. Yeah, they just... Just something about that design, I'm just like, nope, don't... Dunsparce is, Dunsparce is a Pokemon. If I saw them in real life, I would run away. <laughs> I would get the heck out of there. It just, uh, it's upsetting to look at. I'm like, no. What is, what? No. Muck backwards is smelled snake. You got it. Sunfisk also is like that. Yeah. <laughs> Sunfisk. Very, very good Pokemon. Very good flat terror <laughs> Pokemon. Jason, have you seen Rat Boy Genius? No, I have no idea what that is. I feel like the less a person knows about the origin of a Pokemon design, the more they like the Pokemon. Quite possibly. Jason, what are your thoughts on green tea? I like green tea a lot. I drink green tea with Jasmine a lot. Jason, will you ever do a 24-hour stream? Yeah, sure. <laughs> some, po some point. 
some point I'd, I'll do that. It'll be not great, but I'll do it. What other YouTube YouTuber would Jason cross over with? I mean, probably none of them. <laughs> I don't know how many YouTubers I would be a good fit for a crossover. Jason, are you excited for the upcoming American Horror Story? I actually haven't watched that show. Scuffy watches it. I have not. Twenty-four hours. Count me in. <laughs> sure. Yeah, at some at some point I'll do one of those. What you know? Why not? Why not? I'll do I'll do a whole a whole day worth of stream. Just non-stop stream. Just the stream won't stop. <laughs> It'll just keep going. I feel like the game grumps would love to have Jason on. Love is a strong word. <laughs> I think, I think it's not impossible I would end up on some sort of Game Grumps thing as a guest on account of, like, uh, Aaron is familiar with me, at least. Like, we follow each other on Twitter. I like Aaron a lot. I'm not super familiar with all the Game Grumps stuff, but I do, I do like the Game Grumps, even though I don't watch their, <laughs> I don't watch a lot of their stuff. Like, I'm not actually super into the Game Grumps stuff, but I do like Aaron, Do you like JonTron? No. <laughs> no, not not really. Have you ever played the best game ever, Roblox? No, I have not. How is <laughs> is Roblox the best game ever? Jason, how many shoes do you think people wear on average? Two. Jason, what Star Wars movie is your favorite, and which Star Wars movie is your least favorite? My favorite and least favorite. Well, least favorite is pretty, pretty easy, I guess. I guess it's just episode one, I guess. <laughs> like, I, uh... I remembered all the prequels being really bad, and then I rewatched them again, and I was like, "All right, well, three is not the worst <laughs> of them. Three is the most watchable. One is the worst." I don't want to say my favorite again because every time I say that, people get, <laughs> people get upset upset with me at my choice of favorite. It's it's much less. I've already uh, said Mudkip I don't like, so I don't want to. <laughs> I don't want to say any more. Any more controversial things on stream. Saying I don't like Star Wars Episode One is like one of the least controversial, <laughs> unpopular statements I can say because it's it's pretty much. Everyone's like, oh yeah, yeah, that's that's the one. Does anyone remember the Harry Potter Puppet Pals? Yes. Very good series. <laughs> I like Puppet Pals a lot. The best Star Wars prequel thing is the Clone Wars TV series. Yeah, I've seen I've seen a couple episodes of that, and it seemed good, and I keep meaning to watch more of it, but I just haven't had the time. My favorite is Return of the Jedi, and I don't care who knows it. Sure, you live... <laughs> you know, live... That, that's fine, that's... <laughs> I, don't, uh, I don't find the Ewoks annoying, so you know what? I can, I can see it. You can have whatever favorite movie you want. <laughs>
This question time in Game Valley is like good practice for press conferences. Oh, I don't think... <laughs> I cannot imagine this going well as a press conference. I don't know. Already I've said I don't like Mudkip. <laughs> Do you like Mudkips? No. When are you running for president? This year. Can I run? I don't think I'm old enough. <laughs> I don't think I'm old enough yet. I think I'm close. Jason, my girlfriend, and I started playing Ori in the Blind Forest today, and the intro made us cry for at least five minutes. It was very sad. Yes, <laughs> it's a very sad, very sad intro. I like, I like that game a lot. You have to be 35 to run for president. All right, when is the next? <laughs> you know, I think I, I, I might be 35 by then. I'm 33 now, so it's possible I'll be 35 for 2020. Because that's two years. <laughs> so, you know what? Sure. How many times do you giggle while recording voice lines? While recording voice lines, not a whole lot. I mean, I do sometimes when I'm improvising. You know, I used to, <laughs> as far as the president thing, like, there was definitely a point in which I was like, no, I, why would I run for president? There's no way that I'm qualified to be president of the, <laughs> of the United States of America. And then, and then the host of The Apprentice became president, and I was like, well, you know what? <laughs> yeah, I, got, I could be president, sure. <laughs> that, could, that could happen. That's the thing that could actually happen, and then, <laughs> yeah, well, you know what? Yeah. Have you ever watched any Osamu Tezuka manga anime that isn't Astro Boy? Uh, I don't know. I actually don't. <laughs> I actually don't know if I have, on account of I'm not familiar with that person's body of work. Start off slow, first become mayor of Titusville. Man, I would have to live in Titusville then. <laughs> no, no, thank you. I mean, Titusville's, Titusville's not terrible. It's just, it's, it's pretty bland. It's, <laughs> it's a pretty bland Florida town. What are you planning to do next Game Boy Night? Uh, I'm not sure. I'm not sure. I gotta figure out. I, I do, like I said, I do want to set up a day, like a specific day every week where I play Game Boy Advance games. I just gotta figure out what day that's gonna be. So probably when I finish one of the games that's currently in the roster, that that day will become a Game Boy day. Play good games. <laughs> yes, I will be playing good games on the Game Boy Advance. Why do people hate Phantom Menace? I just, I don't think it's a good movie. <laughs> like, I understand people who, like, saw it as a kid and have nostalgia for it. Like, that that totally makes sense. But, I don't know. It's just not, in terms of story and, and acting and characters and all that stuff, I just don't think it's particularly compelling. Like, Jar Jar Binks isn't great, but if it was just Jar Jar Binks, I could deal with it. I like the music a lot. I like... A lot of the visuals are pretty flat, but I, I like a lot of the uh, the art design still. But overall, I'm like, it's just <laughs> it's just the writing. Writing, not great. The pod racing is entertaining. Yeah, that's that's like the single good seed in that movie. What's your favorite band? The Fiery Furnaces. 
GBA has such a great mix of garbage and hidden gems. GBA Night should be fun. Yeah, that's kind of my uh, my favorite kind of system. That's why I like the Sega Saturn so much, because it's like, there's so much garbage on the Sega Saturn, and also so many hidden gems. Controversial, I hate the pod racing scene, so boring. That's fine. <laughs> you know, people people hate it, people like it, I don't know. I, I, uh, I thought that's the, like, the only decent scene of the film, but I also understand people hating it. I hate the whole, pretty much the whole movie, so... <laughs> Jason, please, name my female turtle, please, don't give up on me, let me down, run around, or desert me. Okay, turtle names. Slayer. There you go. <laughs> that's, that's your turtle name, Slayer. Please save Ray William Johnson. Why? Why would you want me to? <laughs> what is what is he even doing? What is what is Ray doing? Is that who I think it is? Is that YouTuber? Yeah, that's him. <laughs> so what was he doing these days? I never watched his stuff. I can't remember if he's like one of the people who turned out to be terrible or not. <laughs> I, I lose track of that. What games do you really want to stream but don't have? I... Hmm. Hmm. I don't know. I do <laughs> I have no idea. I can't... Th I can't think of any. Like, the games that I didn't have... That... Because they were, like, too expensive, I've gotten, like, reproductions of. So I don't... I don't know the answer to that. I don't have one off the top of my head. Jason, do you like chocolate? Yes. Yeah, a lot. I made some cookies. I made some cookies uh, last night. Still got a bunch of cookies. I'm going to eat a bunch of cookies after the stream. I made some uh, some cowboy cookies. It's got chocolate chips and coconut and pecans. And oats. <laughs> Just got a kind of a, a whole lot of stuff. Can I have a cookie? Sure. Everyone, everyone can have a cookie. I don't know how I'm going to get them to you, but <laughs> you know what? You know what? Sure. If a fan were to meet you in real life, what are some do's and don'ts? Well, don't... Don't, like, hit me. Don't, like... <laughs> don't, like, flip me over or something. Don't do any of that. I think I think the main thing the the the, <laughs> the main thing I have when when meeting people in public and I've only met people in public like generally at like the few conventions that I've been to and uh the hardest thing is that a lot of people like usually I've got a whole lot going on and there's a lot of people around and I'm on my way to do something and then people come up and they don't have a good idea of how long they should hang out. <laughs> so it's like, it's cool to to just chat for a second and then move on. Like, there was, there was someone at uh, Playlist years ago who just kind of hung out for a long time. <laughs> I, just, I was just like, man, this person's still here, huh? <laughs> person's still around like you know I didn't dislike them they were fine they were fine it was just a little we it was as someone who has social anxiety in general just having this person I don't know just there and not leaving <laughs> they're just they're here this person's here now they're just here they're here for a while other people are coming and going and this person they're, st they're, st they're still there 
that that's difficult. Also, it's weird because like the only thing we can really talk to talk about when someone comes up is like they're very familiar with with me, and I have no idea who they are, <laughs> and so that creates this automatic imbalance where it's like the only thing we can talk about is me, and that that's <laughs> like that's a weird conversation. Just just imagine talking with someone, and the only thing that you can talk to that person about is yourself. That's it. <laughs> it's, uh... It's... It's weird. Because I don't want to bring up... Like, I don't want to bring up some, uh... Some other topic, because it might be a terrible topic for that person. Like, I might be like, Oh, hi, you like... You like canoeing? And they're like... My brother just died in a canoe accident. And I'm like, oh, 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 well, I messed up. I'm gonna... <laughs> Sorry, I'm just gonna fall over now. I'm just gonna roll away. Bye. See ya. <laughs> See ya. See ya later. Farewell. Yeah, so I don't, I don't know how to, how to deal with <laughs> in-person stuff. Don't even mention Charlie the Unicorn or Llamas with Hats. Hit him with some hardball, hardball journalistic questions. Yes. Yeah, that's a good idea. Just, uh, just interrogate me. That's, <laughs> that's perfect. I'm sure you do fine, though, Jason. You're a nice dude. Uh, I do fine most of the time. Sometimes I'm super anxious and I get very quiet. And people think that I'm upset. <laughs> people think that I'm that I'm super angry because I'm just like I'm just standing there with a blanket expression on my face, hardly responding to anything. And people are like, "Oh, this person must be real mad." <laughs> and inside, I'm like, ah, "No, <laughs> help me! Ah, oh, God, help!" <laughs> So, yeah, sometimes I do okay, sometimes not so much. When you go to the games tour soon, are you going to ask the clerk if he watched the stream? No, absolutely not. <laughs> There's no way. <laughs> no, definitely, definitely no. In fact, like, just the fact that that person now, that one game store clerk now knows who I am, I'm like, well, hmm, well, I'm gonna go to this place, like, a fourth as often now, because <laughs> it's just, like, just the, uh, the anxiety of walking in and having someone there know who I am is like, well, can't go there, because <laughs> this place is forbidden now. Why is the link so warm? That's a very good question. I have no idea. I have no, I have no clue. It's uh, I I can't even really tell if it's warmth. It feels warm, but more of it in a like, I feel more complete and happy sort of way, like a a mental warmth, and I can't tell if there's if there's actual temperature warmth to go along with it. I have no idea. I cried in front of the Moe's employee today, so now I can never go back. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I've definitely had reactions places in which I'm like, well, just cross that one off the map. <laughs> that place no good anymore. Can't go there. Like, I'm sure it would be fine. I'm sure they wouldn't care, but you know what? I, I care a lot. <laughs> I care a whole bunch. Jason, is Nick your religion? No. Play Splinter Cell on GBA. It's notoriously difficult. Oh, notoriously difficult. That sounds that sounds right on my <laughs> right on my alley. That sounds like exactly the sort of games that I seek out. 
I want to find the hardest son of a gun games I can. Golden Sun, yeah, I have Golden Sun. I got I got two of the two of the Golden Suns. I would definitely play those. Well, I think that's 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 it for today. I think we <laughs> this is like a half hour worth of questions. That's probably too much. But thank you all for joining me. Thank you all for tuning in. I'll be back t uh, tomorrow for Mario Bros. Mar Mario All Stars on the Super Nintendo. We're play playing the first the first Mario game. I think we're at the last level, the last world. Yeah, the la <laughs> we're at the last world. So we're going to defeat the dastardly Bowser and then move on to Mario 2 on Mario All-Stars. Farewell, everyone. Thank you. Thank you for, for everything. <laughs> have a great day. Have a great evening, night, morning, whatever it is for you. Until next time, I love you all.